Hey guys, what's up? It's your Reese. Welcome back to another one of my videos. If this is your first time here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also turn on your post notifications so that we want to upload my next video. You'll be the first to know. As y'all can see, I'm about to show y'all how I do this quick and easy, cute little jumbo braid hairstyle. Um, on my hair of course <laughs> as y'all can see the struggle is real because i do have 4c hair so it like shrinks up a lot like i get a lot of shrinkage so um the struggle is real when it comes down to putting my hair in a ponytail it's not easy but let me tell y'all what you're gonna need number one a brush you're gonna need a toothbrush or like something to lay your edges with. You're also gonna need something to tie down your edges with. You're gonna need some scrunchie, some edge control, of course. I'm using the 24 hour edge tamer edge control. I got this from the beauty supply store for $7.99 and it is very much worth it, I'll say. It's a lot better than those cheaper edge control product and of course you're going to need some braiding hair i'll say this is about one pack of braiding hair and this is cankalon braiding hair um i've used this hair before this why it's like crinkly and whatnot and the ends are already uneven so you know i won't have that straight across even look that's just not cute if you are just now taking your hair fresh out the pack basically just kind of like stretch it or whatever you know to get that look the reason why my hair is like this number one because it's a little dry i did damp it with a little bit of water so i can achieve the ponytail a little easier but i wore a ponytail like this the other day and i just ain't did nothing else with my hair so i just been walking around girl looking like this <laughs> so um anywho first things first Put your hair up on the table. And you can do your ponytail pretty much anywhere you want it. You know, as far as like how high or how low you want it, it's up to you. So I just do like a, you know, regular schmegler ponytail. Lay my edges, nothing special, you know what I'm saying? You can lay your edges however you like. Nothing fancy, but like I said, if you got more time or if you wanna you know, take more time on your edges you can. But I'm just showing y'all like the basic. It's time for me to get a new edge control brush because <laughs> this ain't laying it like it used to. And I, I'm sorry if I'm talking low because it's like three o'clock in the morning, girl. And I'm sitting up here trying to do my hair. <laughs> You just want to make sure you got like a sleek ponytail. Just try to get it sleek down as much as possible. That's the goal. Whew. My arms be so tired when I be trying to do a ponytail, for real. The struggle is real, boo boo. The struggle is real. And then I'm just gonna put it in like a little ball and tie this around. So I'm gonna do it. I don't even know if it's on there good, but tie this around the edges. I put it on the wrong way. I don't know. Maybe my head just a little something. I don't know. It just feels weird. Like it's hanging and shit. <laughs> but whatever. I'm gonna take this braid in here, right? And 
with your other scrunchie. Basically, you're gonna tie a knot. So just take the scrunchie and pull it like this, okay? And then just make basically make a knot with the scrunchie onto there. But let me show y'all again, just in case y'all didn't catch that, because I know I'll be moving fast sometimes. So, take your scrunchie. And pull it. Okay? Pull it down. And then take the back side and just pull it through and that should give you a knot. Then just take, the scrunchie, to a ponytail, around your ponytail, if that makes sense, tie a ponytail around your ponytail, okay? On the opposite side of whichever side you want the braid to be on. So I want the braid to be on this side, so I'm gonna tie the scrunchie or the ponytail scrunchie <laughs> on this side. Then I'm just gonna simply flip it over like this. All right, just strain it out a little bit. And carve it into like three sections so I can get a braid going. Right. Then you're just gonna start braiding. And you don't want it to be tight if you want a loose jumbo braid. So just braid kinda loosely. switch it up um it's plenty of ways you can do this you know what i'm saying you don't necessarily have to do it exactly how i do it i'm just spraying all the way to the end the reason why i'm braiding mine all the way to the end too because like i said um i be reusing my hair girl i be recycling okay so i just braid all the way to the end sometimes i wet it sometimes i don't it just depends on if it needs it or not. Cause um, I've wet this hair before, previously. So like, it should be okay. Yep, that's how mine's look. I just kind of go up here where the top is and just trying to make sure that my ball is in there real good and covered up. Well, at least it should be, girl. Let me know if it ain't, okay? Let me know, cause I can't see that down. <laughs> and then if you want to also, you can kind of get like a bobby pin and pin this down, like right up here if you want to. Um, but that's totally up to you. And then I just go through and kind of loosen the braid up a little bit more. You know, give it that. Give it that little jumbo look. You know, just play with it until you get it the way you like it. But yeah, this is how I achieve the look, girl. Quick and easy. You know what I'm saying? My edges don't really want to stay down that good because like I said, I'm running out of edge control, but it's all good. I'll pick up some today. But <laughs> girl, quick little easy hairstyle. Okay, especially when you just want to switch it up real quick and you want a budget. <laughs> Go ahead, girl, get you a little dollar pack of hair from Beauty Blast, though. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, you can wear these high up, 
you can wear this low you can do two of them you know what i'm saying do it however you want to do it okay girl anyways if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if it helped you out you know what i'm saying give it a thumbs up if you do do this hairstyle make sure you send me a picture girl because i want to see how your hair look you know what i'm saying so send me a picture on instagram at underscore reese renee or you can send me a picture on snapchat at miss reese west and anyways make sure y'all subscribe Turn on your post notifications like I said. And I will see you guys in my next video. God bless.